Hey everyone, it's Fia and Makeup. Today I'm going to be talking to you about um, Benefits Box Blushes. Um, the, I'm going to show you the ones that I have. And also, um, I wanted to show you something that no one should ever have to deal with. Um, but also, I wanted to feature the newest one that they have is the Havana Box um, Blush. This is it right here. And this is what the inside looks like. It just comes in. Oh, it just comes with a brush, which have been used, and I like this brush because it's slanted, so um, it is very easy to use. You can swirl it all together, or you can use each color separately, but it's very hard to use, use each color separately. There you go. So here's what it looks like. And um, it has four colors. It has like a light, cre like a light cream color. Um, a plummy color, a regular baby pink color, and a peachy tone color um, that has glitters in there. So you can swirl it all together for, this is the swatch for it right here. Come on, focus. I'm focusing. Can't really see it. It's very light. Um, and I'm saying that, I'm thinking that it would be very, um, cool tone for a lighter skin. It kind of works on my skin. It barely kind of actually shows on my skin. Um, it is good as a highlighter on my skin actually. And so I, that's what I use it for. I put this on first and then I have to, I put this on and I kind of bring it up this way. And, um, and then I have to use a kind of like a more pinkier color just right on the apples of my cheeks for um, some color. Like today I have this on underneath. Um, as you can see some highlights right here, and then I use the Bella Bama, uh, which is more of a pinkier tone. And my box is kind of dirty, but sorry. Anyway, so this is Bella Bama right here. Um, and this is a beautiful color. This is the swatch for it right here. And I have it on today. Can't really see, but it swatched pretty well on my arms. Hope you guys can see that with this lighting. Um, and the one for Bella Bama comes with this brush right here. It's really cute. I love these brushes. It is really light, but then it is very dense. And so when you put it on, it's, it feels really nice on. And I guess this is their new packaging for all of their blushes now, which is kind of nice. It has a, kind of like a magnetic connect um, closer to it. Same with this one. This one doesn't have um, that much shimmers on them, all around it, but I, I like the design of the box. Okay, and the next one that I have is Coralista. It's one of my favorites. It's a peachy color right here. And this is a dupe for um, Max Dainty. Okay, so I have Max Dainty right here. So this is Max Dainty, and this is Coralista. Even though they're dupes, they are kind of um, pricey. But this, this dainty was a limited edition. So here's so here's the um, dainty right here, and then here's the Coralista. And the dainty has more glitters in the, than the dainty does. And it's kind of like a more um, a watermelon tone. So it's not an exact dupe, um, as has been told. But I do love this Coralista color. It's very wearable, and it's just very easy for everyday wear. Okay, and then the last one that I have from them um, is this right here, and it's the Hula bronzer. I love this bronzer. It's like my go-to bronzer, and it comes with this brush. It's just kind of like a, a flat brush. So I have three of their brushes. I have the flat one, the dome-shaped one, kind of, and then the slanted one. So, and I, I almost want to say that the slanted one would be better for this here. So I just might switch that out, but here's the um, here's what it looks like, and here's a dupe for it. Uh, here's a swatch for it, and it's just a perfect matte bronzer. And I really don't like um, bronzers that has sparkles or glimmer, uh, shimmers or anything like that to them, because I just like my face to look matte um, because I'm oily already. And another one that I have um, is Dandelion, and I just have a small sample size of it. 
but it's fairly um, usable. It's this baby pink color right here. This color doesn't show up on my skin very, very uh, well. So just kind of dab it on for light colors, I guess. Um, but I'm not a big fan of dandelion. It does not show up on my yellow um, tone skin. Alright, so those are the ones that I have that I want to share with you guys. And this is like their brand new one that just came out um, recently. It's their newest one. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. But another thing that I wanted to share with you guys is this right here. So Georgia by Benefit. And this has been discontinued. Um, but I happened to pick this up in a swap. And um, I just wanted to show you guys the differences between the two boxes, uh, between the boxes. And this right here, Georgia Peach, as you can see, it says Benefit right there, is a fake. Um, so there's a lot of ways that you can tell by a fake Benefit box. And I kind of had a feeling when I did the swap, swap with her, but actually I kind of had a feeling that this was a fake when I did a swap and I was kind of worried because the swap that I did for this kind of went like it was like my very first swap on Makeup Alley and it took forever for me to get this okay it took forever for her to receive my end and then it took her forever to send this out to me but I finally got it and I was so happy because um, it's the real thing so the first thing this one says not for individual sale because I guess she got it in a little kit or something like that but um, the first thing this right here any like benefit box powder will have this peel out right here and then it re recloses like so easily so um, let me show you so this one I also got in a set so that's why it says not for individual sale but um, see this it, like I peel it off so easily and it's like re-closing so easily. Uh, same with these newer edition boxes. Um, see, see how that goes? And so on and so on. Um, with this one, look at it. When I peeled it, this is what happened. Okay, this like this writing on here is like stuck on here and then this See, you could peel it, but you, it's not smooth, and then it's not going to stick back. It's like a sticker sticking back onto this thing. Okay, so that's the first thing. Um, there is this right here. There's a misprint on here, and they took a needle and poked it out. Okay, so this is how it was when I got it. All right, and then third, um, look at this packaging on the box. Can you guys see that? Can you guys see this right here on this edge sorry for my gross ugly nail i'm gonna let them breathe for a while so i'm not gonna paint them for a while but anyways um can you see how how like not lined up this box is right here here is the real box right here is the hula it's not the same box because this is discontinued i can't get this anymore but look at that okay and then looking at the box itself right here. Can you, can you guys see that these right here is not lined up straight? Like this side is like so much fatter. And then this side is like crooked. And this right here is the most noticeable one. It's, it's like, can you see that? I don't know. And then the box. Okay, so this is this right here. It just feels really, really nice. And even when you hold it, it just kind of slides out like really, really nicely. Same with the Benefit one. This one barely slides out. But the Georgia, look at it just comes straight out. Like, like it just drops out like that. Okay. So on the inside, can you guys see that? Can you guys see where it has the like the cover? of the box and the pan is like opened where it's like cracked see that right there like this right here the pan is like not even filled to the top and she said that this thing was brand new okay so and then there's a hole like in between 
Like I almost want to squeeze this thing and the pan will come out. So that's really poorly designed, of course. Here is the real deal. You can see there's no space in between the pan and the box itself. Um, and same with the Coralista. Like, there's no space in between at all. And it's very smooth. And one last thing, um, the the crack right here where the the box and then there's the covers. Of course, they didn't do it um, very nicely because there's like a big open slot right there in the middle between the two where the corners are supposed to meet. Okay, so that's the packaging. Okay, and all of these blushes by Benefit, they're known for having a great scent. I just love using my Benefit box blushes because it smells so good. And um, even with this new one, this Hervana one, like I just want to use it because it smells so good. It just has that really powdery, girly, fruity smell. This one has kind of like a fruity smell. And this one also, um, this one, I just, I, I don't know, I just love opening them and smelling them. They all have a different scent to them. And this one doesn't have any scent to it. Like, doesn't have any scent to it at all. It is pretty pigmented. As you can see, it's very powdery. I don't know what the real Georgia Peach um, looks like. It is powdery and it's pigmented and it is kind of smooth, but I don't know what it is, so I don't want to put it on my face because it's fake. So, um, yeah, I just wanted to share that with you guys. Just be on the lookout if you're trying to order some box powder from uh, Benefit, you know, buy Benefit off of eBay or something like that. There's a bunch of fake ones out there. Um, I would not suggest you order anything from eBay. Or swap for them, even. Um, if you're swapping for them, ask, ask them for pictures on the inside. Ask them for pictures like of the inside of a box, slanted, you know, up, down. If it's the real thing, they would be able to take a picture for you, and you would see it right away. Same with this one. Um, and I didn't know about it until after I had arranged for the swap with this one. And then I messaged her, and she offered me, like, other things right away. She actually, I think she ended up... Um, paying for the item that I sent out to her instead of having me send it back. I was, and then I asked her, I was like, so do you want me to send this back to you or what? She's like, no, 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 you can just toss it for me. So she knew it was fake. So, um, yeah, that's all I wanted to share with you guys. Um, thank you for watching, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.